topic my dear in case of vcrs cycle so in this topic we are going to discuss about what will happen if we will increase condenser pressure of the vcrs cycle okay so here we have condenser here we have evaporator let's give name one two three four okay so this will the refrigerant will flow like this in this direction so if we we'll increase the condenser pressure little bit increase its condenser pressure so what will happen this is 2 dash this is 3 dash okay now let's see this is 4 dash let's see the effect the effect of increasing condenser pressure in case of uh, refrigerant effect okay so refrigerant effect is denoted by re so before increasing condenser pressure we have refrigerant effect h 1 minus h4 this is before before increasing condenser pressure after after increasing condenser pressure what is happening refrigerant effect h1 is there only so h1 minus but h4 dash we have h4 dash so what is happening here because of increasing condenser pressure refrigerant effect is refrigerant effect is decreasing did you note that so what is happening we should not do that i will tell you why we should not do that because it will increase the operating cost of the refrigerator if we are using vcrs cycle and we are doing this experiment okay this is theoretical but we if we will do practical we can also get the almost same result we are going to get because it is fruit okay now let's move to the other parameters other parameters means w for work and iyp means work input so what will what will happen to work input yes this is important you need to understand this and before now let's say before increasing work input is equal to h2 minus h1 after increasing after increasing work input is equal to h2 dash minus h1 that means work input is increasing again if you we'll go to the another parameters which is relating these two terms work input and represent effect then what will happen that is cop coefficient of performance cop is equal to desire effect or refrigerant effect upon work input so if it is increasing and if it is decreasing so what will, what will happen we can say the cop is decreasing okay as simple as that that means as till now we have seen three parameters and in these three parameters what is happening refrigerant effect is decreasing work input is increasing and cop is decreasing so let's go to the another parameters that is volumetric efficiency volumetric efficiency formula is 1 plus c minus c p higher upon p lower 1 upon n c is clearance ratio that is known as that is a, that is very i mean very useful term we use that okay i have already explained about it in my previous videos okay now what is happening here that n is polytropic index okay now what is happening here pl 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 this one is constant okay ph is what increasing that means what will happen what will happen pl is constant this is increasing that means whole term will increase if this term will increase then volumetric efficiency will decrease okay so these parameters as we will increase the condenser pressure on these parameters you will see these changes i hope you understand if you did not get the whole concept then watch this video again all right so i hope you got something from this video and hope to see you again in my next video bye bye